Defensive controls, guys. Let's see what they are. There have been numerous additions to defensive play this year in Madden NFL 2005. Let's take a look at some of the big changes. The biggest addition to defensive control is the hit stick. Using the right thumbstick, you can sell out and try your best to lay a big hit on the ball carrier. Hit stick tackles are much more likely to cause fumbles, but also run a high risk of being avoided. Let's look at how it works. Here you are, a linebacker, and a receiver is heading your way. As he goes up for the pass, quickly move the right thumbstick in any direction and lay the big hit. Now watch what happens if you miss timing. As you can see, there's a definite risk to going for the big hit rather than trying to keep your form and bring him down. Here's another example. The ball carrier has decided to change his mind and not follow his blocker. Bad idea. You come up on pursuit. Quickly move the right thumbstick in any direction as you approach and ouch! As you can see, you can really change the momentum of the game by risking it all with the hit stick. The hit stick is for real! Script ball system. By just holding down the black button, you can reach out and try to grab That's right guys, there was no R1. Once you make contact, your defender will White button, black button. the ball out with the other hand. As with the hit stick, this is a high risk maneuver. But as you can see here, the rewards can be great. Another new addition to Madden NFL Playmaker. 2005 is the addition of advanced pre-play defensive playmaker. Let's go. Defensively, you can alter the assignment of every player on the field, as well as change your rush scheme on the fly. Let's take a look. In this case, your linebacker is in a blitz assignment. You realize that everyone else is in man coverage. And the Peerless Price, this Atlanta offense was unreal. Player, unreal. Move the right thumbstick left. And now your player is in a quarterback spy assignment. What? Let's see another example. Here, you have an extra defensive back that is covering the pullback. You make the call on the fly that you aren't worried about the fullback getting deep in pass coverage. Love it. So move the right thumbstick down. And now your player is in a blitz assignment. Ooh. You can change the player's assignment to four other variations as covered before there is a blitz and quarterback spy, as well as a flat zone and deep zone assignment. To coincide with the defensive playmaker controls, you can also change other aspects of this the This was play so play revolutionary, play. you have no Take idea. A look at these. There are many different adjustments you can make to your defensive line. Ah. Let's start with the ships. If you pull the left trigger, notice the banner that says line audible from there look at the difference in controllers this is the one i really use or down to pinch the defensive lineman in tight if you're expecting a run up the middle also you can press left or right depending on which way you want your defensive line to shift you don't have to just change their position their assignments can be changed as well to do this pull the l trigger again then move the right thumbstick up now the defensive lineman will take a looping outside rush. If you want them to crash the middle of the field, just move the right thumbstick down. There are two more options with the right thumbstick. Right will make the defensive lineman crash to the right at the snap, and left will make Detmer the defensive in the game. No Vic must have got left. injured. Another aspect of defense that has been improved in Madden NFL 2005 is the coverage audibles. Let's begin with the basics. To call a bump and run coverage, press Y, then down. Watch as all of your defensive press. backs line up to press any receivers. To back up all of your defensive backs if you are expecting a deep pass, press Y, then up. If you are in man coverage, press Y, then right, to make sure that your defenders get into the right position. They will then line up directly in front of their assigned receivers. To try and disguise your defense and make it look like you're bringing the house, Press Y, then left. Almost your whole team will line up at the line of scrimmage as if they're going to blitz. Will show blitz? That their assignments don't change just where they line up. The next aspect of coverage audibles is a little more advanced. Madden NFL 2005 now gives you the ability to press or play off of individual receivers instead of controlling the whole defensive backfield. Huge. To do this, Huge. press Y, the passing icon of the receiver you intend to press then down on the directional pad. In this instance, you want to press the primary receiver. So, press A. To back the defensive back off of this receiver, press Y, A again, then up. Now your defensive back is going Huge. to give that receiver a little room. 
you also have the ability to manually double cover any receiver as long as you have a safety currently in a zone. Here's how you do it. First, press Y, then the icon of the receiver you wish to double team. Again, you want to double the primary receiver in this example. So press the B button. After that, press right. The safety closest to that receiver will now be assigned to double team it. Huge. As you can see, so you couldn't do it from the guy, but you needed a guy in a safety. And powerful before the play. I would recommend getting in practice mode to test everything you I want. love this guy. Tony Bruno here, signing off. Tony Bruno told you to get in practice mode. Are you going to listen? It's been in the game since 05. Where are you? People who can't.